guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Sneha, and in today's video, I'm going to talk about the book Grit, written by Angela Duckworth. Now, to be very honest, this book is one of the best self-help books out there, and I'm not kidding, and it's not an exaggeration. So I know there are a lot of self-help books out there that claim that they are going to change your life, but I don't really think that happens a lot of times. What happens is that those books have very little substance, and those books are full of fluff. So if you don't know what does the word grit stands for then grit basically means courage and bravery now you must be wondering is the book all about courage and bravery well not really because this book is about so many different things that are related to succeeding in life and beyond that so there are so many words that float around us for example hard work talent luck smart work etc but what is that one factor or quality that actually leads a person to become successful in their life so is it hard work or is it talent or if there is a chance of luck that will make you successful what is it that will actually make you successful so this is what the book is all about it is about discovering how a person becomes successful and what are the factors that make them successful what makes this book a gem is the fact that there's a lot of research that has been done by angela duckworth in writing this book so this book was not written out of thin air she actually devoted a lot of her time into this book so she went ahead and interviewed a lot of successful people and their family members to know the mindset and the upbringing that leads to a person's success she also arranged for a lot of debates so that she could understand different perspectives of the same issue so that makes this book really not biased and i really love the fact that so much of study went behind it so it's not like she's just telling you her ideas those ideas are well researched and there are surveys that back those answers that she is giving you in this book so what is the measure of grit grit basically is a combination of passion and perseverance so if you have passion for something and also have the perseverance to go ahead and continue doing that one task then you are gritty because a lot of times we have the passion but we don't have perseverance and that's why we fail at something so in this book angela duckworth not only talks about grit in detail but she also goes a step further and tells you how you can grow grit in your own personal personality and character so there are two ways in which you can grow great one is inside out another is from outside in these are the two ways you can grow great another best part is that there are so many real life examples in this book that will actually inspire you and they are not preachy at all what she did is she took all these examples she interviewed all these successful people and then she broke down their stories into parts to tell you how they actually succeeded in life so there are different factors that are involved right there is upbringing there is a background story so there is usually an entire journey that is responsible for a person's success and how they actually grew that grit in their character so there's also a ted talk by angela duckworth on youtube i will link it in the description down below you can go there and watch it but that ted talk is really not that great i think like the book that she has written it is everything but that ted talk is not really the best talk i guess this is basically for my beginner friends this book is not going to be the best self help book for you i think you have to start with other easier books because this book has a lot of research and examples and it might get a little overwhelming for you because you are not really that acquainted with the reading thing but if you really want to read it if you really want great then i would suggest you can get this book the thing is the language is not the factor why i'm telling you not to get this book if you are a beginner i think it's just because the book is very dense in character that's why i think it will be better if you start with other books that are not that dense otherwise if you are a reader and you read a lot then this book is definitely for you the best self help book for you especially for people who are looking for an advanced self help read because there are a lot of self help books that are not really for advanced readers i think if you are an advanced reader and if you want to read something that that is not ordinary or something that has never been talked before or something that is you know more ex more advanced and more researched then this is the book for you all right guys so that was all for today i hope that this video was helpful for you if it was then do not forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so you are notified every time i upload a new video and i'll see you next time until then goodbye